hello students welcome back let's take up the next question so the next question is if the power of the eyepiece l2 is 5 diopter and it forms an image at a distance of 80 cm from its optical center at what distance should the object be so here we have been given the image distance that is image is formed at 80 cm from the optical center we have the power of the lens given so using power we will find out the focal length so we have the focal length we have the image distance we have to find out the object distance there are four options given and we'll have to find out the correct one so let's start so we know power is given as plus 5 diopter so the relation between power and focal length is f is 1 by p so using that we get 1 by 5 that is 0.2 meter which is 20 centimeter so here we have the focal length is 20 centimeter so we write here f is plus 20 centimeter so if it is plus 20 so focal length is plus 20 that means it's a convex lens it's a convex lens Okay, so now what else is given? Image distance. So image distance V is given as 80 centimeter. Okay, so now we will use here two conditions of the convex lens ray diagram. So now there are several ray diagrams, but out of that we will use the two cases in which the first case is If the object is kept at focus, image is formed at infinity. The second case is if the object distance is less than focal length image is virtual and erect okay so these are the two cases which we'll be using for this question so now coming to the solution here we have four options given. So let's take up the option D. Now for option D, it's given the object distance U is 20 cm. Now we have the focal length as 20 cm. It means that if the object will be kept at 20 cm, that is the focus, the image will be formed at infinity as per the condition, this condition. So for if the object is kept at 20 cm, the image will be formed at infinity. That is the image distance will be infinity. So this option is not true because our image distance is given as plus 80. So as per option D, the image will be formed at 20 cm. If the object is at 20 cm, image will be formed at 80 cm which is not coming to be true. So this option is ruled out. Now coming to the other three cases we have in option A u is 12 cm, in option B u is 16 cm, in option C u is 18 cm. So in all these three cases the object distances are less than the focal length which is 20 centimeter. So the image will be virtual, erect and it will be formed on the same side that is as the same side as the object is. So now let's find out what is the value. So let's look at the ray diagram here. 
this is optical center this is f1 let's say this is f2 so these are 20 cm so object distance for all the three cases a b and c our object distances are somewhere here 12 12 16 and 18 centimeter so our image will be formed somewhere in this side only object will be here and image will be here why because one ray will go parallel it will pass through focus another one will pass through the optical center if we retrace them back we will find out the image to be formed somewhere here so Let's find out the object distance. So what is given here? So F is plus 20. V is minus 80 centimeter. Why minus 80? Because it is formed on the same side that is on the same side as that of the object. So in order to measure the image distance, we will have to go towards the left. So image distance is minus 80 centimeter so using lens formula 1 by f is 1 by v minus 1 by u so 1 by u will be 1 by f sorry 1 by v minus 1 by f that is 1 by minus 80 minus of 1 by 20 that is minus 1 by 80 minus 1 by 20 minus 1 by 20 over here so we have 1 by u is minus 1 by 80 minus 1 by 20 LCM is 80 minus 1 minus 4 so 1 by u is minus 5 by 80 which is 6 so sorry 16 so u is minus 16 centimeter so here we have u as minus 16 centimeter so u is minus 16 centimeter which is option b so this is the correct option that is the image if the image is formed at 80 centimeter from its optical center it means that the object is at a distance of 16 centimeter from the optical center i hope you have understood this now Thanks for watching.